playing. Like, who's the most technical player that we've ever seen? My answer would be Sakuroko. Yeah, I'm not he, sure what. Oh, yeah, he indeed, is. indeed. He's he's got one of the most. I mean, impressive executions in in, in the world of Street Fighter Four that yeah, I've ever the seen. The knowledge that he has for all the games. Yeah, yeah. It's I amazing. Mean, any, any character that he's ever picked up, he's he's done amazing things with. I remember his Rose back in Days of Super. You know, he was really really strong with her too. And so, we're seeing now, we go. we've got we're seeing now that we got a hot cut in top 32 wow. and in winners. Yeah, and yeah. This hot has been so really well. Show. I don't know what his Ibuki knowledge is like, though. I don't know how many Ibukis you have here in Brazil. Not but many, he's gonna, not many. But he is going to be... Ooh! Oh, my goodness me. That was sick. And Hakan looking good right now. I mean, I'm not... Wow, he's going in. This guy doesn't business, boy. Oh, he missed something there, and that might cost him. Oh my goodness me, he wanted to close the round with that, but it hasn't worked. Oh and God. he got the ultra! And it's first round to Hakan. What a sick ultra that was. And Bravo. that's going to be it, how Hakan closes up with Ibuki's face to the wall here in Twitter after match 2013. Let's see if this is going to be a lucky shot or if Hakan's going to be able to And the crowd are going wild right now. Finals. The crowd are going absolutely crazy. They can't believe they are seeing Hakan take Sako apart right now. But it has only been the first round, so it's all to come from here. And Sako, with those one-frame links that he's famous for, gets him stunned. Combo, neck breaker. What's it going to be now? Oh, Kunai. I think that was in front. He went for oh, wow. What an air grab. Reads it. Yeah, it was always going to be that. He wanted the escape. And he's going for chip now. That's all he wants. Yeah, it was always going to be chip. One round apiece. Brilliant play. Nice comeback. Oh, wow. So two bars for Hakan. Oh, not sure about that focus. Oh, no, he's giving him a combo. Don't give Sako combos, man. That is on the side of my cereal box. That tip of the day, boy, on my cornflakes. Oh, and he's really close to stun here. He doesn't want to get hit by anything else. Couldn't get out the stun in time. And after that amazing start, it's all come, it's all falling apart here. Yeah, and it's just chip damage again, yeah. And yeah. Sako said, oh, so I heard you like lucky games. So let's see how you can turn a match on that. I, I, I actually think that he could have won that game. Okay, I don't think that Sako downloaded him. I think that Hakan got too greedy. Once he got that first round, because it was so convincing, he was very, very comfortable. He was very, very comfortable with that, and he tried to take the match too much into his stride. I think he should have bided his time a little bit more. Yeah, the, the thing that changed that he, he was blocking like everything in the first round. Yeah. And then on yeah. The, the, the following one. Yeah, he had to bide his time. Yeah. Oh! That drop kick, boy. WWE! Oh no, too early on the command throw. Doesn't get it. And Sako all over him. Okay, gets the oil. Gets the oil. That BP. That BP, boy. That, that Kuwaiti oil. Shout out to Yusuf. Oh no! Eats the overhead, and it is match point Sako here, who hasn't needed to counter pick. Ibuki has proved successful. Ibuki has been like uh, the go-to character first, and then of he course, takes all yeah, the changes yeah. when he needs. Yeah, Ibuki is his speed out character, and then he takes it from there. And Ibuki is doing more than feeling at this point by bare elbows, knees, kunais, everything's going on right now. And Almost done here. Yep. Oh wow, that wasn't even a counter. I think it was a stand for something. And the links. The and even, and even if he's missing the combo, it was still enough.